Hey there, Internet. I'm Kyle, and apparently I'm playing Final Fantasy VII Remake on the PS4. I'm great at driving. On our last episode, we had a super sick spear bike battle. Not used to having any. And maybe you should just let me drive. Now we're getting more sexual tension between Jesse and Cloud. Guess I'll take one for the team and be your back warmer again. This is Jesse's theme. I hope she doesn't feel my boner. Oh, would you look at that? It's the end of the ride. All right. So we're at the Shinra factory. Don't want to draw too much attention to ourselves. Yeah, I'm not like having a huge high-speed battle. <laughs> they got you on the good. freeway on motorcycles oh, and I'm running on fumes. <laughs> don't worry we'll top you up soon enough now let's roll the running fat jokes <laughs> all right Ah, oh, the ominous blinking fluorescent lights. The residential area is just beyond this gate. Mind doing the honors? <sighs> there we go. Oh, I gotta hold. Oh, wow. Here we are. The employee housing district, where they put you when your parents work for Shinra. Hmm. While their reactors were slowly killing the planet, we were living the good life. Someone's playing hard to get. That's adorable. Steal his child's bicycle. Is he gonna stop me at some point? Or am I just free to run around doing all kinds of crazy stuff? Type like that. Think she'll make us pizza? Her Midgar special? Ooh. She's quite the cook. Quick to whip up finger licking food, even if you drop by in the dead of night. And she loves guests who ask for seconds or thirds. Okay, let's head in. Cloud, you know what to do. No. Make your wait around the corner over there. Uh, okay. It's a shame you won't get to try the Midgar special. You would have really liked it. Wow, literally around the corner. With your help, we won't need luck. You'll take on just about any job, right? Well, I need you to rob my house. Think you can do that for me? Whoa. That's intense. Go in through the back door when the coast is clear. The signal will be obvious. Once the lights come on, it's go time. Alright, I guess we're gonna go rob Jesse's parents.
inside, you'll find a room with two doors. Don't take the one in front of you. You want the room on the right. That's where you'll find it. I kind of want to go on the one straight ahead. Just because you told me specifically not to. This will always be your home. So, how's practice going? It's slow. You get so fixated. You side of things. We'll be chatting mom up in the kitchen, so don't even bother being quiet. There's no way she'll ever hear you. Oh, Lord. Dad'll be in there, but it's okay. That's heavy. That's really heavy. I need you to grab his Shinra ID card. And yeah, I know I should do it myself, but... But I honestly don't think I'm up to it. Just do this for me, okay? My dad. He was a maintenance supervisor at the reactor. Time to sneak out now. Why do I feel like I'm about to get caught? I did it. When are you going to give up on the gold saucer? How long has it been since you even performed? Uh, people really rely on Jesse. As a stagehand, though, right? You can be one of those anywhere. So why not come home and get a job at the Sector A Theater? Uh, I'll think about it. Lord. You know, I'd really love to stay and chat, but we gotta go. So soon? Yeah, well, we hadn't even planned on dropping by, but Wed wanted some of your famous mm. pizza. So good. Sure I can't tempt you with some more? Maybe just a couple slices, Mrs. R. Wed! Hey, I'm, I'm doing it for you guys. You don't want me going to work on an empty stomach. I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. Since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Hey there. This is. Now comes the hard part. I'm gonna use this to sneak into the 7 6 annex. Uh, all right, let's get to it. Sorry, but you're staying outside. Only I know what to steal from where, so it's gotta be me who goes in. So, we came all this way just to eat pizza? <laughs> you think I'd let you off that easy? You're gonna earn every slice helping Cloud. Just do the thing where you draw everyone's attention away, like you did at my parents. What's the word again? Maybe I'm more nervous than I thought. Diversion. Yeah, that. Nice one, military man. So what? Does this mean we're gonna ask some Shinra folks out to dinner? <laughs> uh, you know damn well what she means. Can you just punch him in the balls? Inside, we make sure the guards are focused on the outside, yeah? Exactly. Couldn't have put it any better. When you see a flare go up, that's your cue. Rush the front gates and make for the warehouse plaza. The more hell you raise, the more time you buy me. Huh. You're gonna run this guy into the ground, aren't you? How much time do you think you'll need? Not too much. I'll be in and out. I'll send up another flare when I'm done. We rendezvous in the vacant lot up ahead. All right. How are we supposed to get back to the slums? Wait for the first train? No. I want to be back before that. Don't worry. I have something worked out. Now, 
Let's get this done. Well, that diversion's not gonna create itself. Jesse's dad was in there. Right? Who? Mako poisoning. Happened while Jesse was doing a show with the gold saucer. Uh, what do you care? No. I wanna hear it. Jesse always wanted to be an actress. Worked her ass off for years. Until finally she caught a break. Top billing. Parents were thrilled. And then, right before opening night, her dad had an accident. Collapsed from overwork. And in the worst possible place, Mako storage. Lay there half a day before someone found him. Been like that ever since. No change whatsoever. And that's what got her into planetology. Led her to seek out Avalanche. How far we've come. Yeah, I just wanted to say, like, this is super heavy and, on a personal note, pretty relatable content right now. So, sorry if I've gone quiet. Like, that's... Jesse's got a theory about it. Thinks her dad's spirit is stuck now, between his body and the heart of the planet. So if we don't shut down the reactors soon... He'll get caught up in the flow and poof. <laughs> What's so funny? Just that I understand how you feel, unlike most of the time. I see. Mako is the essence of life itself, of memory and hope. It's not something you burn in a reactor just to keep the lights on. Hell no. Oh, uh... Don't tell Jesse about this little chat, okay? When she gets pissed, ooh, she gets punchy. Well, no promises. Be serious, Cloud. She'll beat the shit out of us. <laughs> Not my problem. This guy. Hey, it's the lot Jesse was talking about. We run into here when we've got what we came for. Gotta stay hidden. Wait for the signal. It's so quiet. Just need to get past this gate. Wait, where are the guards? I do not like that base. <laughs> Looks like someone beat us here. I don't think it was Jesse. This had better not get in the way of our plans. Oh, it certainly will. It won't. Don't see anyone. Oh, hell. Hey, man, the plaza's that way. Warehouses are further in. Jesse's supposed to be circling around from the back, right? No need for us to rush. Let's scout it out first. I can handle this solo. What? You're trying to keep us out of it now? Don't be a jackass. We're in this together. Don't expect me to save you. If you need to check your gear, now's the time. Get the word when you're good to go. You can use that vending machine over there to stock up. All right. I guess there's a training center too. Could go a few rounds before the main event. Man, I get really hungry when I'm <laughs> nervous. All right, let's see here. What we got? Oh, we got armor and weapons. All right. All right, accessories. Oh, I got a lot of money now. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and buy one of those for me. See, they have all the material I already have. Um, I'll buy all three of their high potions, and I'll buy their ether. Uh, I think that's all I really need. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and buy some Phoenix Downs. All right. Uh, so I can rest here, right? Take a seat on this sick park bench. All right. There's a 
training center, huh? Um, I'm gonna go ahead and make a save here, just in case I am woefully unprepared and need to train. I haven't saved in a while either. <laughs> Should probably start doing that more. Summoning material, don't you? There's no better way to deal with big groups. You'd be crazy not to equip it. All right. Hope I've got everything I've done. Spare mags. All right. I guess that's a very strong hint to equip my uh, my Efrit materia. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and. I'll get rid of fire for now and just use the Ifrit. Where is it? Do I not have it? Oh, does it have its own slot? Okay, that's useful. Okay, cool. So I don't have to take anything off either. All right, let's do this. So, y'all set? Okay, let's go over the plan one last time. Okay. Everybody take a knee. You start things off by cutting loose where everyone can see you. <laughs> and us? We're the backup. First, we climb high enough to get a vantage point. Then we go to town on them. Hey, yeah. So, what did you want to talk about? When spring comes, I'm leaving town. I'm going to Midgar. Should have figured. All the guys are leaving. But but I'm not like them. I'm not going just to look for work. I'm going to be a soldier. The best of the best. Like Sephiroth. Ooh, buddy. <laughs> Great war hero, huh? I got bad news. <laughs> Isn't it pretty hard to become a soldier? Yeah, so I won't be back for a long time. Guess not. Think you'll be in the papers? I'll try. Just promise me one thing. When we're older and you're a famous soldier, if I'm ever trapped or in trouble, promise you'll come and save me. Huh? That's what heroes do. They save people. Please? Just once. Uh, come on, promise me. Fine. I promise. you're having second thoughts I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference but not like this I just I feel trapped oh cloud you know what you gotta do buddy that's the signal all according to plan. Let's go. Right. Yeah. Sup, nerds. I don't see any intruders? Maybe they went home. Oh, hey, over there. Target 
Uh, he should be in two pieces. Oh yeah, come on. Give me these mobs of easy to kill enemies. of easy to kill dorks. Actual enemies. Uh, let me see. Let's take care of this guy first. Target you with a uh, no battle targets. Okay. Oh, nice. Uh, where are you at? Oh, there you are. All right, I remember you guys. Oh crap. here oh yeah here we go that's not great Eford is. I wonder how I summoned him. Alright. Anyway, let's get back to this. Let's do this. 
got him. Come on. Bring it on, dog. break again nice ah uh, go ahead and just do some reg potions all right where's that last one our wedge where are they oh there we go come on be all of them, right? All right. Think I ran off the pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Hell of a show, man. If only the ladies loved you that much. I'm glad someone's enjoying themselves. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, two of them. Uh, get out of here, Wedge. Ready? Hell yeah. More than you know. Look what I found. Let's give these jerks a taste of their own medicine. The summon gauge. When facing a formidable enemy in battle, the entity slumbering within an equipped summoning material may begin to stir, and the summon gauge will appear. When this gauge has completely filled, you can call upon the summon for assistance. Okay, so that's what's going on with that. All right, uh, I'm just gonna try and oh, not item spell. Get some more uh, thunder on this guy. Oh, so I can summon now. All right. Oh, yeah, he laid mines. Ah, uh, first summon though. Oh, that's freaking awesome. All right, so they're gonna fight aside alongside me for a brief period of time. Blah blah blah. Will of your own. Okay. Sick. All right, well, first thing I'm going to do here is uh, go ahead and heal myself up. Uh, Crimson Dive, yeah. Come on. 
There we go. All right, that's one down. Oh my gosh, but I am almost dead. So we are gonna go ahead and uh, do that. Uh, yeah, crimson dive this guy. And yeah, just keep it up. Go ahead and thunder. Up, oh, you out of here, Ifrit. I feel like something else is about to happen. to be set free fall back uh, right uh, come on uh, uh, well this ought to be interesting it's been a long time since I fought a duel out of the saddle but for all the miles on the clock I'm just as fast as I ever was. At last, a long way to begin. Here's to a fair fight, my friend. I'm waiting. Let's do this. Any time now. Uh, materials proven enough. Oh, more potent spells. Okay. So let's uh, try Fyra. Ow. That hurt. Yeah, what do you got, buddy? <laughs> I told you we were gonna push it past the red line. You're a nerd. Try that again. Ow. Oh my gosh, I might die here. Yeah, that wasn't good. That was... Yep, I'm gonna die. Oh my gosh, my ATB just won't fill. That's actually our first game over. Um, I'm going to go ahead and call an episode right there, guys. Um, thank you so very much for watching. If you liked what you saw, be sure to like, comment, subscribe down below. I'm Kyle, apparently. Now I will see you next time.